Hey, hey, hey guys. I know it's been a while. Um, I am not at my goal just yet. It may hit six weeks before I get to uh, my 160 goal uh, of pound, uh, 160 pounds lost. And overall, it'd be like 180, I think, for overall weight loss. Anyways, I'm not there, but I'm making this video real quick, just um, real quick, because <laughs> I'm still babysitting right now and doing all of that. Um, so I get this question a lot. Is it necessary for me to lift weights to lose weight? My answer is no. Scientifically, it's proven that cardio actually helps you lose weight faster and more efficiently. Um, lifting weights, you still do, your heart rate still rises, you are still um, burning calories, you're still doing all of that. The difference is, is especially with me, I mean cardio in the beginning is a must. You, you need to get your cardio in and get started like that. But I also love to lift weights. So if you're just looking to purely lose weight, yes, you can just do cardio and you'll lose the weight. But with me to shape my muscles, to shape uh, my body into what I want, because guys, I have a flat butt. There's, there's nothing there. I've never had a booty, nothing like that. And, uh, I've worked very, very hard on building muscle. When you build muscle under fat, you're not going to get rid of all the cellulite. I mean, that's it's really hard. You have to get to a very, very low body fat percentage for that to happen. But the muscle underneath the fat, you know, brings it out. It smooths it out a little bit more. And with me, it's really helped. You know, my arm area, especially since I do have, you know, a little bit of loose skin, but can you imagine if I was not lifting and doing all of that, it would be worse. Now this arm is a little bit worse than the other, but I'm building that muscle. I'm still doing all that. See, when I put it down, you can see that fat, but that's fine because I guarantee you it was much, much larger. You can go back in the pictures and, uh, decipher that for yourself. It was significantly larger than it is now. But building that muscle up underneath your skin is going to help shape your body and kind of mold it to what you want. You know, you can lose the weight and your body and your skin will just kind of sit on top of what you've got. And that's great, you know, if you're just looking for it purely for health. But if you're looking like me, I'm still young. I, you know, even if you're older, I'm not, you know, saying because you're old, don't do it. Uh, lift weights at any age, you can. I'm not saying lift powerlifting, you know, types of weights and, you know, uh, I'm just saying weights in general gives you resistance, helps you tone, helps you build muscle. Um, but for me, it's really the shape of my body that I'm trying to help. And especially since I am losing so much weight, uh, my skin would just kind of hang off of me by now. It would be a lot worse than what it is now. And I'm very thankful that, you know, my husband's into, you know, um, I'm sorry, <laughs> spaced out there for a minute, that my husband is into lifting weights and got me back into it. I used to do it before, like I've said, and this kind of just, I mean, set it in there and I was like, yeah, I can do this. I'm going to do this again. And it just kind of hit me and I love it and it's great. So just to answer y'all's question, yes, cardio is going to help you burn lots and lots of calories. I still do cardio. I am a cardio person or it's just I do my cardio in the beginning I lift my weights and then I'll do some more cardio after and it does it helps me you know kind of mediate I'm building muscle underneath but I'm also burning off those extra calories especially since it is getting harder that I am at a lower weight that my calories are 
you know, tighter. Like I can't eat as much as I used to. And a lot of it is you have to watch your diet. You have to watch your diet and what you're eating and how much you're eating. Not necessarily what you're eating, but if you're going to be lifting and you're going to be, you know, doing enough cardio and just depleting your body of all of its nutrients and using that in your muscles, you need to be nourishing it well. And I always stress that, guys. Eat good. Exercise, whether it be cardio or whether it be weights. If you're looking to get a booty, if you're looking to, you know, tone up your chest, uh, build muscle in your arms, because maybe you're like me and you've lost a lot of weight and you just, you're trying to fill the skin. Muscle helps fill that skin. Now, it's not going to fill it 100%, but if you're like me and I cannot afford, you know, surgery or anything, this is the next best thing. Building your body up and lifting weights does not make you bulky, guys. Like, I lift weights six days out of the week. And I don't mean I just get little two pounders. I'm getting 20 pounders and, you know, curling those, doing back lifts with that. I think uh, I deadlift 135. That's not my max, but that's what I do in sets. So don't think, and guys, I'm still pretty, you know, I've got a nice physique, especially now that I'm losing my weight. It's not bulking me up like a man. I don't have man shoulders. I have nice, sleek, you know, feminine shoulders that I am absolutely in love with. And that's not because I'm losing weight. It's because I'm building muscle underneath my skin. And that's the great thing. And so if you're starting to lose weight and you're just kind of like, I'm not liking the way I'm looking because I'm losing the weight and it's just kind of hanging and I'm just seeing bone or you're just not liking the way that's looking, try it out. Try building some muscle underneath it. That may help you. So like I said, guys, don't be afraid of those weights. Just get in there. Try it out. And if you love cardio and that's your thing and you're not too concerned about physique or, you know, how anything else is looking and you're solely just, you know, uh, worried about, you know, getting at a healthy weight and your cardiovascular system being better, do that cardio. You should do cardio no matter what. I, to me, in my opinion, you should do both. You should do both. Find a mediation. And I'm not saying you have to lift like me six days a week. I'm saying, you know, maybe once or twice a week, you know, get in there and do your arms or do your legs. You don't have to do squats. There's lots and lots of videos that I watch to, you know, give me ideas and new things because I'm very much one of those people who... I get so bored of the same thing over and over and over. Now my squats, deadlift, and bench, those are in there because I love powerlifting and I aspire to be a power female powerlifter, you know, here in the future. So those are like my go-to's. I always I always incorporate those no matter what. But I love playing with the boxes and seeing about doing curtsy lunges off of them. Or, you know, right now we're going to practice with Avalon. And so there's track there. So once a week, I'm doing pure cardio, bleachers, you know, bleachers give you the resistance for your legs. You can still build muscle without the weight. You can do body weighted um exercises. So if you look those up, I would definitely try those. I was doing that in the beginning until I was strong enough to pick up some weights again and, you know, comfortable enough to go back into the gym and really get into it, which is great. Do not worry about what other people are thinking about you because I guarantee you being there, I was that big, huge woman on the freaking treadmill that was like out of breath from walking fast. I was that woman, but it took me just being at a great gym. We have a great gym where nobody is worried about what you're doing or anything like that. Find a gym if you do, if you're interested in a gym. Find a gym that's like a family. They are very sweet people and just they're there for your goals also, not just for their gain. And that's what we found at Metroflex and San Marcos, guys. And it is amazing. Yeah, it is kind of like a powerlifting, you know, um, 
uh, was a bodybuilding type of uh, gym, but the members in there are just amazing. And then there's moms just like me. And, you know, there's men just like my husband that are just trying to get in shape and just trying to do that. And it's awesome the way everybody just meshes together and just really find your goals and what you really enjoy. So anyways, this video was just a real quick, yes, lifting weights can help you lose weight but it also shapes your body underneath your skin. So, uh, doing both cardio and weights, I highly recommend it. So, thanks guys for being so patient and just waiting for my videos. And I know I do crappy videos and I know they're not huge, but for those people who really care and, you know, and I really am inspiring them, uh, this morning, I was at 205.2 so uh, that's great I've got five more pounds till my goal and hopefully I want to say next week or the week after I should be at my goal and uh, I'm fighting these five pounds oh my goodness they're just sticking they're sticking so um, actually gonna go to the gym here later and do that and get it out so y'all enjoyed the rest of y'all's week and I hope this helped y'all and it was informational enough. Go research things guys and check it out. I always say that. Research everything and uh, figure out what works for you. If you like cardio, do that cardio. If you're not unsure about weights, just try it out. See if you like it. If you don't like weights, just do your cardio and body weighted. You don't need weights on you to do the muscle or to gain muscle either push-ups and squats you know without weights and uh, just doing the movements actually help a lot so we'll see y'all later and y'all have a great week